Many times we're also required to give medication intravenously for our cattle. And if medication is in a large volume, we typically will use the jugular vein. I'm going to demonstrate administering medicine through the jugular vein. Again, what I like to do is use my four fingers and place them deep into the jugular furrow to allow for the jugular vein to distend. You can visually identify the jugular vein as it distends. Continual pressure will continue to allow distension of the jugular vein until it can actually be visually seen as well as palpated. Once you identify that, you can steady your hand onto the animal's neck and when you're ready to penetrate through the skin with the needle, you must choose your spot and you must actually go pretty quickly. You cannot place the needle onto the skin of the surface of the animal because she will negatively react to that. So once you've identified your spot, steadied your needle, your hand, then place the needle into the jugular vein. And then once you're into the jugular vein, you draw back, you get blood. Once you get blood, you can dispense the large volume of medicine intravenously. Release your uh, hands away from holding off to allow the medicine to clear the area and then completely remove the needle out of the cow's vein.